name is Matt Blank. I live in Southern California and I'm a professional skydiver and bass jumper. I don't think everyone in the world should be a bass jumper or, you know, could be a bass jumper. But there's a small part of what we do that they can be translated to everyone. It's not about jumping off buildings or cliffs, it's just about living life to the limit of your human experience. So maybe that's to you, uh, accomplishing a goal that you haven't you know, thought was possible or you know, facing a fear that's always plagued you. Once you refuse to be intimidated by the consequences of your actions, anything is possible. Base jumpers, they're more afraid of getting to the end of their life and finding that they haven't lived than they are living a stable life. So it's no decision at all to drop everything and go live life to the fullest. If somebody tells you that they don't fear death, to me that tells me that they don't love anything because they're not scared of leaving it behind. And I'm absolutely scared of leaving things behind, especially before I've been able to uh, share as much and learn as much from these things that I love. Base jumping is a sport, and this is why base jumping is great, where you have to constantly reinvent yourself, constantly re-examine who you are, because you're constantly confronted with changing the way you analyze things, changing your emotional reactions to high stress and risky situations. When something goes completely right and you absolutely nail a jump, then you're on top of the world. And you think, wow, I, you know, could do this for the rest of my life. You're working within the margins of error, and when you have a close call, you're basically confronted with the fact that you're outside the margins, and perhaps there's really no controlling your fate at a certain point. In that one moment, all that who I am led me to climb that rock, jump that jump in exactly that fashion. Yeah, I'm okay. It was uh, a lot of luck, and if circumstances were different, uh, you might have come out completely on the wrong side of it. I got into base jumping to conquer myself, to experience a new dynamic. I probably wouldn't be doing any of that stuff if it were not for the community that I've surrounded myself with. I think if you surround yourself with people that you admire, eventually you're gonna start doing things that you're proud of. If I eventually got to the point where I was like, wow, I did that, jumping, done. Like I did something so amazing that um, I could just quit jumping, then I would definitely quit in a heartbeat. But I haven't found that yet.